Hello guys, welcome. You are watching Technology Welfare. Let's see in this video tutorial how to repair iOS and what are the problems that can be created in iOS system so that you will address one by one. So for it guys actually I have the installed one software that is F2 Kit software. This software has been developed especially for iPhone iOS repairing. So let's see one by one what are the issues that we can address and that we can fix by virtue of this software. So see guys here if your iPhone device has been stuck in yeah, stuck on Apple logo yeah stuck in bootloop yeah if it is demanding that connect your iTunes this device so in that situation there are the various kind of issues yeah if it if it is stuck in DFU mode so see here various kind of the issues this has been given yeah if you're having the problem in a iPhone cloud activations error also you can address by virtue of this software so see guys here, various kind of these shows that you can easily address by virtue of this software. So simply what we have to do, we have to connect data cable from iPhone device to a PC. Now it's connected. Now what we have to do guys, simply we have to go for a start it. Yeah, first of all, before starting if you would like to keep your iPhone device in a recovery mode of course you can keep it just I will click on enter so now see guys my device is switching in recovery mode and when it will be done then it will be green color highlighted now see guys it's highlighted now see here how we will address the problem simply I will go for a start but before going this start, remind one thing that hardware failure, hardware failure is not supported to a repair. So be sure that you are having the problem related to a iOS software, not a hardware. So now what I will do, just to simply I will go for a start. Now see here, we have a two choice, one is a standard mode and second is your advanced mode. So simply, you have to do nothing, simply just you have to go for next. One thing here in mind that advanced mode will erase all the data on your iOS device and this is a standard mode here. Yeah. But see here, simply I will go for next. First of all here, now here it has automatically detected now, iOS, IPSW, just you can see that here, FIMBA 13.4.1, iOS is required. If I download it already, then of course we can select here and I can go for manually. I will select here and then I will go for next. Otherwise, if you haven't downloaded, suppose see now. If I have downloaded, then simply I can go for select the IPSW. Otherwise, here, see, simply I will go for download. So now, see, it has started to a download. So now, see how fast it's a downloading. So, guys, this is very simple way. Thus, you can address the all kind of the iOS, iOS issues. And no need to do anything by virtue of this software, you can easily. So this software is highly, highly useful because as we know that this software has been developed for especially iOS repairing and how to fix the all kind of the iOS issues. So now just I will back here and I will exit from recovery mode. Now it has come. So guys, 
This is all about in this video tutorial. My motive is how you will repair or how you will fix more than 30 iOS issues by virtue of using these tools. So, this is all about in this video tutorial, guys. If this video is acknowledgeable, then don't forget to like and subscribe to my channels because this is a thing that will inspire me to make more and more video for education purpose, guys. So thank you very much. Have a great time.